As America begins to reopen and people head back out to stores and beaches where others are gathering, a new study just released by Chinese researchers suggests that you may want to begin paying attention now to how exposed you're leaving your eyes to the coronavirus, pointing to new evidence they found COVID-19 could enter your body through the eyes in addition to breathing it in. It's a real risk. It's not something that we need to panic about, um, but we do need to be careful. Dr. Sonal Tooley says the American Academy of Ophthalmology had on its own become aware of some cases of American patients showing clues that their infections could have started in their eyes. But in the new study published this month by JAMA and also in the widely respected medical journal The Lancet, Chinese researchers demonstrated how the coronavirus can indeed infect and then replicate inside human eye cells. The researchers cautioned that a repeat of their study with a larger sample size could lead to a better understanding of the risks. But the new report studied the behavior of the novel coronavirus specifically. In 2017, the CDC's influenza division said more broadly that most influenza viruses may be capable of establishing infection if they reach the surface of ocular cells. And if the virus gets to your eyes, it's an easy path to your lungs and other organs. If you think about the, the entire mucous membrane of the, the nose, mouth, and eyes, um, they're all connected. But if something got into your eyes, it could get into the rest of your respiratory system. The researchers in China wrote that their findings are crucially relevant for infection prevention and control, a growing need as more scenes like this emerge, where people eager to get out are packing into tight quarters with no one wearing a face mask. So to protect yourself when you go out, the American Academy of Ophthalmology now recommends that you wear some kind of glasses, of course, in addition to your mask. The idea being that these can help protect you against at least some infected droplets that might be floating through the air. But also, if you happen to touch an infected surface, you'll be one step less likely to then go and accidentally infect yourself by touching your eye. I think that's probably the most important reason to wear glasses. You would have a little bit of a pause because you would hit the glasses and say, oh, wait, I'm not supposed to be touching my eyes. So absolutely, that would be a great way for people to just give themselves a little bit of a pause uh, to prevent themselves from infecting themselves too. Mark Greenblatt, Newsy, outside Washington, D.C.